Hey guys, in this video, we'll be showing you how to disable or get rid of this system update available notification. So if you have an Android device and if you are rooted, basically I just rolled back from Lollipop to KitKat on my Nexus 4 device. And after I rolled back, I was getting this annoying notification to update my Android device to the latest Android version that is 5.0.1. And if I update, it basically screws up my device and it basically my device gets really slow. And uh, I, I don't really like Lollipop that much. I prefer KitKat. Uh, so if you are facing something similar uh, and if you are annoyed by this notification, you just can't get, get rid of it if you just tap on later and it just keeps on popping up so <laughs> today i'll show you how to get rid of this notification in order to uh, get rid of or remove this notification uh, you your device has to be rooted it needs to have the root permission so if your device isn't rooted just go ahead and root the device find out a tutorial on how to root your device if you don't know how to root your android device just uh, comment down below uh, type in your device name and model number and I'll find a tutorial for you and I'll link it uh, in the comments itself and if possible in the description. So basically uh, let's show you the simple uh, trick to uh, get rid of this notification. As I said your device needs to be rooted. So just go ahead and uh, open up your play store that is your google play store and what you want to do is search for disable service and you will find this app by Wanky, W A N Q Y, and you want to install this app. If you don't find this app uh, in the future in Play Store, just let me know. I'll uh, upload an APK for you so you can sideload it. So uh, you just have to download it and open it up. So after you open this app up, uh, you'll see this third party in system. Tap on system, and over here, just search for Google Play Services. So just search for the letter G. Oh, there's G and let me just search for Google Play services. Okay, Google Play services under this new Google Play newsstand. As you can see, just tap on this Google Play services. And now you'll get this list of uh, permissions, basically. So now uh, you can search for system. Just hit the search button and search for system. So basically you want to search for the system update service. You can just search for it or scroll down and find it system update service. And basically what you want to do is you want to uncheck it and it will ask for super user permissions. So just grant it and now it will say uh, it has been disabled. And as you can see, it has been unticked, unchecked. So basically hit the home button here. And now you'll still see the notification here, but you'll have to reboot once. So just uh, hold down the power button and press reboot. Okay. So my phone is restarting now. So let just wait uh, till it gets rebooted. So your device needs to be rebooted. Uh, and then after you the changes will take effect so now just scroll down just swipe down from here and you will no longer see that notification again so that annoying notification is now gone uh, the system update notification is now uh, gone and you won't see that annoying notification coming back again and again so it's gone forever uh, so basically if you still want to update your system if you still want to if you decide in future that okay you want to update so uh, just follow that procedure again. You just have to check that uh, thing. Just open the disable service app and go to system and then just search for uh, Google Play services again and just search for system, system update service and just check it. And uh, that notification should come back again after you reboot. So I'll just disable it as of now. I don't want that notification again. So that's how you uh, basically remove uh, that notification. And now it's no more there. 
So thanks a lot for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit the like button down below. And if you have any questions, any queries uh, related to this, you can ask in the comments, any problems that you're facing, you can ask in the comments and I'll try to help you out. And uh, if you don't know how to root your device, you can also uh, comment down below with your device model number and uh, the full name. And I'll try to find a routing tutorial or I'll try to make one for you. Uh, so thanks a lot for watching this video and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.